My name is Sam Dhanashekaran and welcome to this music theory video series. In this video, let us take a look into naming the black keys. In the previous video, we saw the names given in the white keys in a piano. Now, how do we name the black keys? I mean, these keys. Okay. In piano, you may notice that if we move from left to right, that is, you can notice that the sound gets sharper or the pitch of the sound goes higher. If we go from right to left, the sound becomes more and more flat or the pitch gets lower like this. So, the music theory names the black piano keys by virtue of its location. A black piano key residing above C, right, this is C, okay, a black piano key residing above C is called C sharp. The sharp is denoted using the hash symbol. The next one is D sharp because it's located above D and so on. Okay, so this would be F sharp, G sharp, A sharp. Okay, now I agree that C sharp is sharper than C, but it is also lower than or flatter than D. This is D, this is flatter than D. So can I call it D flat? Sure, why not? Call it as D flat. And the next one is E flat and so on. But how can you know that when I am when I am going to call this as C sharp or when I am going to call this as D flat? For that, let us take a look into scales in the next video. Thank you for watching.